Hi there. Jeff? Hi, Jeff. My name is Ahmed. I'm a nursing student. Um, I hear you came in today for soreness in your throat? Your throat, yes, sir. Okay. Can you tell me a little bit more about? Uh, it's been going for about a week now. Uh, mainly just hurts when I swallow okay. uh, anything, fluid, food, anything. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Um, we'll be doing a, a head, uh, ear, nose, throat exam on you today to try to figure out what's going on with you today, okay? Okay. All right. Um, first, I'm going to be inspecting your head. Um, if, I, if you don't mind, no, I'll take that off. Do you work in a hospital or something? Yes. Okay. Going in for surgery? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, nice. Okay. So first I'm going to do is I'm just going to inspect um, your head, your face. Um, your head looks nice and round. Um, I am going to be uh, palpating for any lesions, uh, any bumps or lumps. I'm going to be feeling your contours there. Feel nice and normal. I'm going to feel your occiput, and that also feels nice and normal. Next, I'm going to look at your face, uh, the symmetry of your face. Uh, it looks very symmetrical. And next, I'll be palpating your temporal artery here, which is nice and strong. You feel the other one here. I'm going to give you a stroke here on both of them. Very good. All right, next one I'll have you do is uh, I'm going to be uh, assessing your TMJ joint, the, the um, temporal mandibular joint. I'm going to have you open and close your, your jaw, your mouth. All right, keep doing that for me. Very good. Do you feel any pain when you do that? No, no. Okay. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to assess and feel your sinuses. Just let me know if you feel any pressure when I press here. Excellent. So that really completes your head exam, uh, or your, your your head and your face. Next thing we'll do is we'll assess your eyes. Uh, first, I'm just going to inspect uh, your eyes, color, um, color of your sclera. Looks very normal. Have you experienced any discharge uh, from your eyes, any redness, no, no, any pain or burning at all? No. Okay. Um, I'm going to have you pull down uh, both of your lower eyelids down so I can look at your conjunctiva. The conju conjunctiva. Uh, they look nice and pink. Very good. They're not pale. Um, and next thing we'll do is I'm going to be using this light source to look into your eye. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to look at the color in your eye. I'm going to look for any lesions uh, inside your eye there. Let me turn off the light a little bit. Great. Excellent. And then what I'll do is I will be assessing the, your, the reactivity of your pupils. Okay, so I'm going to have you look straight at my finger. All right. Very good. Nice and reactive. Same thing here. Very good. All right. And you said no pain or tears or any discharge from your eyes at all. Okay, very good. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be assessing your field of view. So peripheral field of view, I'm going to stand behind you, and I'm going to reach out with my hands or fingers, and I want you to tell me when you actually see them, okay? Okay. All right. So I'll start right here. Just let me know when you start seeing them. See okay, great. All right. See you. All right, very good. See you. Excellent. Very good. Okay, so your peripheral field of view is, is intact. And great. Um, that completes our eye exam. Next we'll do is your ear exam. Um, any any issues in your ears? Any discharge or pain? Um, do they feel occluded like you got water in them or anything like that? No. no. Okay. Um, I'm going to be performing what we call a whisper test. So I'll have you um, occlude or block one, one side of one ear, okay. so you could do this one first. Okay. And then I'm gonna whisper a word to you and I want you to um, tell me if you hear it, okay? okay? Apple. Okay, great, all right. I'm gonna have you do the same thing on the other side. Okay. Baseball, excellent, okay. So you can hear. Yes. <laughs> all right, next thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to be pulling your pinna back, back and forth 
I want you to tell me if you feel any any pain at all. That usually indicates if there's any inflammation. Uh, no? Okay. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Excellent. All right. Again, I'm going to use this light source. I'm going to look inside of your ear. Okay. I'm going to pull your pinna back and up. And we'll look inside. Looks like you just cleaned your ears, huh? Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> All right, here. Your canal looks nice and clean, no inflammation. Um, the panic membrane looks very good. All right, this side here. Go up and back. Very good. Looks very good. Alrighty. Um, that completes our ear exam. Next thing we'll do is uh, your nose exam. If I. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. I'm going to have you uh, flex your neck back a little bit. Yep. And then I can have you just push your, your nose, the bridge of your nose, up. So I can look inside there. Very good. Color looks good. I don't see any discharge or any inflammation. Have you had any congestion or a lot of secretions? Normal allergies. Normal allergies? Okay. Okay. Um, no uh, deviation in your septum. It looks looks very good. Um, last thing we'll do is, um, actually, before the last thing we'll do, we'll, right now we'll assess your mouth and your throat. Um, so I'm going to have you open your mouth for me wide. Um, I'm going to first just inspect to see if there's any lesions. Uh, look at the color of your tongue and your mucosa. Looks looks pink and normal. I'm going to have you stick your tongue out and say ah, so I can look back there. Ooh, look at that. That looks very inflamed. Your uvula looks very inflamed, and I see some white spots. That looks like strep throat there. All right. How long you said you've had this sore uh, throat for? About a week now. A week now. Okay. All right. I'm gonna feel your your tonsils and oh yeah, they're huge, man. They're like baseballs. Yeah. Okay. All right. Last thing we're gonna do is I'm just gonna assess your neck. Uh, I'm going to assess lymph nodes in your neck um, and around your ears, and I'm also going to assess your thyroid gland. Okay? All right. Feel here. I'm just feeling for lymph nodes, which should be about one centimeter big and not inflamed, not tender. Did you feel any pain when I press? I don't feel any pain. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Alright, so next thing we'll do is I'm going to uh, assess your thyroid gland. Uh, I'm going to stand back here behind you and I am going to have you just flex your neck back a little bit. Uh, go ahead and swallow for me. Alright, very good. So I have the throat here, the Adam's apple between my two fingers. Go ahead and, and swallow one more time for me. Very good. Alright. Feels normal. All right, last thing we're going to do is I'm going to listen to your lungs uh, just to hear if there's any crackles or congestions in your lungs. Go ahead and take a deep breath in for me. Oops. 
which can have you set up for me. feel nice and clear. Very good. All right. So we'll have your physician come in to see you. Um, you know, I think the only thing that we saw that was abnormal was your tonsils. They were inflamed. And also the back of your throat looked to have some patchy white spots in it, so, um, which could potentially be strep throat. All right. Well, I hope you feel better. Thank you. All right. You take care. You too.